And you'll put any sensors on this you want so you can know, check something out. Exactly. And where can you fly that legally right now? Or is that a bit up in the air right now? Uh, it, it is a bit up in the air in the United States. So we've been working internationally for the last two and a half years, working with oil and gas, agriculture, and infrastructure. Here in the United States, we're working with Caltrans and Bishop. Okay. Someone wants to know can it carry a baby? <laughs> Yeah, so if, if, the baby, baby. if the baby is between 1 and 40 pounds, it can carry that baby. Carry a baby. Can lasers shoot out of it? Uh, is that a sensor you're, off, you're offering right now? So, are we talking like EDM lasers or are we talking like Star Wars lasers? Uh, I'm not sure. Any of the above, I think. Yeah, EDM lasers, definitely. Star Wars lasers, we're going to try to stay away from. We're stay away from. Can it auto hover? Yes, absolutely. Yes. And it can autopilot. We can direct it to different waypoints and set it on a track. How high can it go, asks Randall SG? We go, gosh, I want to say probably about 2,000 meters up. 2,000 meters, very cool. And then, do you kind of reveal the cost to components here? Is this proprietary information? Um, proprietary, but if someone was interested in buying the individual ring, it would be about $25,000, $35,000 for this model. Our biggest model, which can lift about 80 pounds and stay in the air anywhere for two or three hours, is about 150 pounds. Can lift 80 pounds? That's not just a baby, that's a small child you should carry around there. Very impressive. Okay. Someone says hello from Ireland. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Evan, Thank you. Evan, very nice to meet you. Yes, and we're live on the internet. Yes, we're live on the internet. Okay, great. Thank you.